Hong Kwan. Hi, it's also my first time here. Mm, look at that. Pineapple house. Cute. <laughs> it's my turn. <laughs> it's really brave. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to Pat Max Adventures. I am Patrick, and today I am here with my friend Hong Kuen. Hi. And we are, where are we right now? Um, Ling Jiao. Ling Jiao. We're going to a pretty interesting and somewhat popular waterfall here, and right now we're in the local village here. We took a train from Taipei Main Station to get here. Took about an hour, hour and a half to get here. Then we grabbed some water, some food, and now we're making our way through the village out to the waterfall. Where are you originally from here in Taiwan? Um, I'm from Banqiao. Oh, Banqiao, okay. Yeah, it's uh, like the city center in New Taipei City. Mm. Hey, sweetie. Oh, she's like, nope, I don't know you. Get away from me. <laughs> Things are so weird. So we just came from the train station right over here. Really nice, small little local train station. There's some kind of tour group over here. We're currently on the bridge. You can see the hills over in the distance. Really beautiful day. And then below us is a river. And then here is a little waterfall down here. You cannot jump from here. No, we will not jump from here. Yeah, that looks like a really nice area to swim and relax too. It's also my first time coming here, so. It's your first time here. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Right now we're making our way down to the waterfall. You can see over here, there's some kind of shed and there are three kayaks here. <laughs> That's a really good idea. We didn't bring a kayak, but we did bring the donut inner tubes. So we have to blow them up, then we can just lie out and relax in the water. <laughs> so you can see guys, we have made it to the waterfall. Look at that, super beautiful. So we're still hiking through. There are also some caves here. You can see this cave. Really interesting. It actually looks like it was man-made. It opens right out to the water where the waterfall is. It's partially natural, partially man-made. Yeah. yeah. And you can see there are signs here that say caution. What does it what does it say exactly? Uh, the water is deep and it could be dangerous. Ah. So if you want to do any of water activities, you need to pay attention to your own safety. Because the yeah. water is deep and dangerous. Yeah. They have an uh, emergency flotation device along with a pretty long rope here. So if anyone gets in trouble, this is here to help somebody if they get in trouble. Came across this other rock. What, 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 what room is it? Changing room. Ah, uh, okay. This is your changing room, guys. If you come to the waterfall, you can change into your swimsuit here, and then you can go swim in the waterfall. <laughs> There's our floaties today! <laughs> our inner tube! Yes. So there's some other people on the other side over there. They made that their little beach area. Really nice area. But we've decided to make this area kind of our home base here at the waterfall. And we've got this rock here too. We can hide behind it. What kind of inner tube is it? It's a pineapple inner tube. Yeah. I'm blowing my pineapple, which is currently upside down. Yeah. Like the, you know, SpongeBob and SquarePants. Well, I look like SpongeBob. <laughs> Patrick from SpongeBob. Yeah, with the pineapple house. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. It's my pineapple house. <laughs> <laughs> if you guys want to buy an inner tube and come to this waterfall or anywhere similar to this, you can buy these online, very cheap, and then you can pick it up at 7-Eleven. That's one great thing about Taiwan. They make it so easy to order things online and pick them up. Hung Kian and I have decided that it's pineapple time, right? I feel so cute. <laughs> so cute, yeah, it's very cute. Oh wow, do you see the fish? Yeah, I see the fish. Oh yeah, there's fish down there. A lot of fish, in fact. How, how does the water feel? Is it cold? Is it uh, cold. It's cold? Is it really yeah. cold or a little cold? It's like a lower than 20 degrees Celsius. So you need to be a little bit adventurous to dive in. It might be cold for 10 seconds. Yeah. But afterwards, it will be, you will feel really like relaxing. Okay, okay. Oh! oh. <laughs> Ouch! <laughs> maybe, maybe a bit cold. Yes! <laughs> got it, you got it. Ow. 
Hold. He says it's my turn. So now it's my turn to get in the water, guys. Looks really refreshing. now here at the Lingjiao waterfall and you can see there are people here but it isn't overly crowded so if you want to visit a waterfall near the Taipei city area that isn't overly crowded but you still get these magnificent waterfalls and a great swimming area I highly suggest coming here on a weekend or a time that you have Patrick I know you can do it Ooh. So I did it guys, I finally jumped off that rock, which I had a lot of hesitation. After seven minutes. <laughs> seven <laughs> minutes. But I had to keep thinking of a rock I jumped off in Hawaii. It's at Hanama Bay and I was like, Hanama Bay rock, Hanama Bay rock. And then I flew down like an angel and slapped my hands right on the water. Not the most graceful jump. No, <laughs> but it's I did not. It. But he did it alone, so he's really brave. <laughs> There's also a little river that goes down from the waterfall and leads to another waterfall. So if you look down this way, guys, you can see some people sitting on the edge. There's another waterfall on this side, much smaller than the one in front of me here. Too. This water pressure is crazy. Look at that. Look at that girl over there just chilling in the middle of the river there. So cute. Look at this water, guys. Look how clear that is. Leading straight to another waterfall right here. That's the larger waterfall and the larger water hole. We're gonna jump over here and just relax in this kind of open water lagoon. River. Yeah, this nice little area. Hong Quinn is gonna jump here. This is much easier. Oh, woo! Now it's my turn to jump and relax here in this beautiful lagoon as the sun begins to set. We just dried off and hiked up to the top of the waterfall here because Hongkian wants to see how high it looks from the top and wants to understand why I was so nervous. And I think you guys will understand why I was so nervous as well. How do you feel? There's no way I'm going to jump from Yeah, no way. So guys, you can see this is the top of the waterfall here. Right here. Now, I think a lot of you can understand why I was so afraid. We have made it back to Taipei Main Station, and as you can see, I am totally red, and Hong Kian is very not red. <laughs> I'm so jealous. I mean, I'm brown all the time, so. <laughs> <laughs> Even with sunscreen, I still get red. So what did you order for dinner tonight? Indian beef curry. Yeah, the clam is really authentic and traditional Indian curry. So, but in my opinion, it's kind of localized still. Yeah. yeah. Like a localized. localized. How does it taste? A bit sweet. Yeah. I mean, it tastes like Indian curry. You ordered a typical Taiwanese steak that you can find all around Taipei. Some eggs here, some vegetables. I've got my cream soup. And then I've got my roll right here and some noodles. These Taiwanese steaks always come with corn soup, which is very typical. It's always usually pretty sweet. Let's see. Mm, very sweet. It goes good with the steak. Now, of course, to try the steak itself. 
I love these steaks. Then there are the noodles, which I always found so interesting, a combination of the steak and the noodles. But after being in Taiwan for a while, it makes sense. Mm. It's a bit sweet too. We just had some good dinner here at Taipei Main Station. If you come here, you can always find food upstairs. Really good dinner and it's been a really fun day. If you guys have any questions, feel free to leave them down below and make sure to live every moment to the max. I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye. <laughs>